country way. Welcome to Angel Stadium. Major League Baseball on tap. It's the Seattle Mariners and the Los Angeles Angels. First pitch coming at you right after the break. Just about ready to roll. And on the mound today, Carson Fulmer. What's the scouting report on him? Well, the big thing is that the way he holds his curveball, it's more of a knuckle curve. And because of that, it's less predictable in terms of the break for the hitter. That makes it that much harder to hit this guy. J.P. Crawford gets a chance to hit. Leading off the afternoon for Seattle, the shortstop, J.P. Crawford. Riding to the plate. At the ball. Misses just the off the outside edge. I think that was a strike. Caught a break right there. Pretty good pitch on the outside corner. Three two now shoots a line drive single into right center and the lead off man aboard Mitch Garver up to hit here Mitch Garver back to work three two now knocks that one away and we'll do it again. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Crawford gets his lead at first with nobody out. Foul ball left side, he'll see another. The pitch. That's foul off to the right side, keeps the A.B. going. Also really good at that. What I like about this guy, his bat stays in the zone for a long time. Gives him the ability to foul off tough pitches. Right-hander kicks, deals, and that's ball four. Base knock, and now a free pass. This has the makings of a big inning if they can get a couple more quality at bats. Next to hit, Cal Raleigh. Oh. Falling behind two and one. Could be some action here on this next pitch. Couple runners on, probably a challenge pitch coming. Next one is off the plate. Three and one. Julio Rodriguez up next for the Mariners. On the ground, two ball. To second, there's one. On to first, double play. I think four, six, three double plays like that are way tougher than these guys make it look sometimes because no matter how you do it, the feed from the second baseman is a tough one. That's where footwork really comes into play, but right there, very well done. Three, two on the way. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Sometimes he wears the emotion on the sleeve, but that's okay as long as he's getting results. And right there, thrilled with the punch out to get out of a jam. Back here at Angel Stadium, and pitching in this game, Logan Gilbert. Power pitcher. He's going to speed you up with the fastball velocity, and out of his hand will explode the breaking ball. Very difficult for hitters to keep that front side closed and hit the ball the other way because they know if they're not ready to pull the trigger, the fastball will beat them. Bottom of the first. So in now for the Angels, number 18. Off the mark there. Three balls and a strike. Drilled out towards left center field. That's well struck. That's bad. And it hits the fence. Into second with a double. And they've got something brewing now. 
Well, when you fall behind in the count, you've got to come into the zone, and then guys have a better chance of hitting the ball hard like he did right there. Brandon Drury to the play. Next offering is in for a strike. No outs. Runner on second. And now the Two count balls. is even. That one just misses. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Got him looking. Not what you're looking for after the leadoff double. A strikeout, and there's one away. Frustrating end to the at-bat for the hitter, and I'm sure that's going to sit on him for a little while. You want to be ready to hit the fastball. Sometimes you can overthink things, and I think that was the case right there. And a swing and a miss. And now two gone. So back-to-back -back strikeouts now, and they still haven't managed to do anything with the leadoff double. Yeah, Boogie, and you just don't want to get careless here. You've done a really good job to get two outs after that leadoff double, as you mentioned, and just got to execute your pitches, and it's a non-issue. Willie Calhoun stands in here, and down on strikes he goes, and the inning is over. Angels leave one. We played an inning. No score. Back in Anaheim, new inning getting started, and now it's the switch inning second baseman, Jorge Polanco. Here's a one two. And that one missing low. And that's downstairs and outside. Got it by him for the K. Luke Rayleigh up next for the Mariners. Here's a 1 1. And that one just missed off the outside edge. And there's a foul ball. One down, base is empty. Just off the outside edge. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Second inning here, no score. Swing and a miss. Got him to go up the ladder for the K. Back-to-back -back strikeouts to start the frame, and that's now three in a row. Yeah, he's really settling in and getting a feel for his pitches, throwing them where he wants to right now. So we'll see how long he can keep this streak going. Swings and misses. And a count one and two. Three down in it. And one, two, three, go to Mariners. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. Bottom half of inning number and two. Up. And here's the rookie catcher, Logan O'Hoppy. Logan O'Hoppy. Next offering is downstairs. And that one lifted in the air center field. Rodriguez settles under it, makes the catch, and there's one gone. That is good. Mickey Moniak, the next to hit for the Angels. 
A wind in the pitch. Now one missed. Two one now. Fouled off left side. Two two. Back to the mound. Tosses to first. Two up, two down. Batting seven. Number nine now at the plate. Swings through that. Two strikes. Gets a piece and stays alive. And a pitch. Fights that one away. Still one and two. Good eye right there. The guy at the plate could recognize slider out of the hand. Didn't stay in the tunnel very long in terms of depth and perception. He knew right away it was an off-speed pitch. And that one is lifted in the air. Nice grab on the run. And that is that. Angels go down one, two, three. We'll move to the third with no score. Well, here we go. Top of the third scoreless game at the play. Josh Rojas. Righty delivers. Out to short. Tosses across the first. And one away in the top of the third. Good fade and sinking action of that changeup. Got that hitter to roll over. Here's Dylan Moore. Top of the third, no score. Next offering is in for a strike. And now two and two. And the right-hander deals on the ground. First two batters oh. retired here in the top of the third. J.P. Crawford oh, up next three. for the Mariners. Shortstop. He's one for JP. one, let off the game with Crawford. a single. Two outs. Lifted in the air, right center field. Adele makes the play, and that is that. Mariners are down in order. Still no score. Back here at the ballpark, and set for the bottom of the third. Angels. So in now for the Angels, the right Joe Adele. Joe Adele. Bounced up the middle. On the run, sends it over to first. There to beat him by an eyelash. Knew he had to hurry after that nice forehand grab, and he did. He couldn't have transferred the ball from his glove to his hand and released that throw any better than he did right there. Fair ball. Well, they call that an advantage count for a reason. You're so much more likely to get something you can handle. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the ball straight to it. That's great work right there. To second, but way too late, safe there. That one drilled left field. Two down. The throw is wild and it gets away. And now Brandon Drury struck out looking in his first at bat. Guillaume stands at second with two gone. Next offering misses. 
Two and one. Two one. And there's a breaking ball that drops in there. And this guy's got a great feel for his breaking ball today. That one hammered left field. That's back. And that one's gone. He sends a rocket to left, and they add a pair. It's 2-0. was a hanger and pitchers typically don't get away with making a mistake like that and right there he made him pay so two down Taylor Ward getting ready to hit struck out swinging his first time fouls one away and now three and two the pitch the right-hander gives up the two-out walk. It's been a little bit of a shaky inning, but he's still in a good That's spot to get out of this five. thing without giving up any more really? runs. He's just got to turn the page and go after this next guy. Left-hand hitter waits. Ball, that six out. On the ground to third. Rojas throws on to first. That ends the inning. But two come across to score in the inning, courtesy of this two-run homer. And it's two zip. Back after this on the show. And welcome back as we go to the top of the fourth. Now it's the Mariners DH, Mitch Garver. After scoring runs, this is where you're looking for that shutdown inning. Get that hot team back in there to swing the bats. The count two and one. Just missed. Expect for that guy to come right at you with a fastball, something in the zone, because he does not want to allow the leadoff wall. And that one is lifted in the air. Adele moves under it. And puts the squeeze on that one. One away. Here's the catcher to hit. Cal Raleigh. 0 for 1 so far. And yeah, now two balls and a strike. And he deals. Fouled off to the right. Stays alive. Kicks and fires. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Really love the pitch sequence right there. I'm telling you what, pitcher and catcher on the same page right now. And now it's Julio Rodriguez. Rodriguez. He was a strikeout victim his first time. In the air out towards right center. Adele going after it. He's got it. And that is out number three. Nobody left for Seattle. And they're down 2 nothing. Welcome back. Ready to go. Ready to go. Bottom Before four. The Here's the catcher, Logan Ohapi. Oh, and a 1-1. One, one. Bounce to third. Rojas throws oh. on to first. And one gone to the fourth as they get the leadoff man. Mickey Moniak will hit next. Grounded out his first time. 
the wind of the pitch. Moniak tries to check his swing. Now a look to third. No swing. Well, he opted to go with the off-speed stuff on that 3-2 with the bases empty. Close pitch. But now he's got to work out of the stretch. Here's a 2-1. Pop foul out of play off to the right. Instead of letting the hitter get his arms extended, tied him up a little bit, slightly up, slightly in. The pitch. Double play ball to second. Good feed. That's one. And that's two. Three up, three down for him there. On to the top of the fifth we go. Angels two and the Mariners nothing. We go to the top of the fifth. Now, Jorge Polanco. The 1-1. And that one a little bit high. Action in the Angels' bullpen. Hans Kraus appears to be getting loose. Garcia warming up as well. Two and one now. Check swing. Now an appeal to third. And he held up. At the belt and fires. And a strike. And boy, that was the pitch. 3-1, you want to be really aggressive on the fastball. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. That could jumpstart an offense that's really struggled to score in this one. Don't want to wake a team up with the free pass. Now a screamer into the outfield. And there's one away. On the mound now, Kenny Rosenberg. Well, at this point of the ball game, we're talking about middle innings and the little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. And now the lefty, Polanco on the go. One ball. Throw there. Safe. And two now. Can't connect on the curveball, struck him out. Man, it's so tough to let a slow curveball like that one just travel all the way into the contact zone. You see it out of the hand, and you're telling yourself, off speed, stay back. But you just get too excited, you think you're going to hammer it, and you still end up way out in front. There's the swing and a miss. <laughs> The 2-2 two -two now. In the air, right side. Adele moves under it. Puts the squeeze on that one, and that'll end the inning. One left for Seattle. They trail it here, 2-0. Back here at Angel Stadium, we head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's Joe Adele. The wind of the pitch. That one down the line. Rojas throws on to first. And the leadoff hitter retired in the fifth. Fastball groove right down the middle. Usually a lot of damage done with that pitch. A hard grounder, but he wanted to get that ball in the air. Maybe drive it into the gap. And that one hit to first. And he handles it himself for the out. Now batting. Back to the top of the Angels lineup. And next for the Angels, number 18. Two down, nobody on. Going to count one and two. He's pitching well, but not throwing a ton of first pitch strikes. Usually doesn't work out for success, but you can never predict baseball. That two missed balls, inside. Two, two balls, two strikes. This to third. Rojas throws on to first. 
Three up, three down, inning over. No runs, no hits, no errors. We're through five. Angels two, and the Mariners nothing. Back here at the ballpark, here's the left fielder, Dylan Moore. Ball to strike, the pitch. And that's in the dirt. Activity in the bullpen for the Angels. Ben Joyce, the rookie right-hander, is getting loose. Ripped to third and picked on a hop. Fires to first. And that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the six. The bat, number three, shortstop, J.P. Crawford. J.P. Crawford up next for the Mariners. Line drive, caught! Nice swing and good solid contact. Up all the smoke, but needed a little more lift to get into the outfield the gap. Maybe a little more backspin. Mitch. Now Garver. it's the DH, Mitch Garver. The 1-1. One -one. Way out one front ball. for strike two. It's been tough for the offense so far, but you can't get frustrated. you got to find a way to shake it off, go up there, and relax. That's the only way you're going to be able to put runs up on the board. Next offering down in the dirt. Got him swinging. Offense held a check there. 2-3-4 due up in the home half of the sixth. Angels two, and the Mariners nothing. Well, we go bottom six. Here's the second baseman, Brandon Drury. And leading off for the Angels, the second baseman, Brandon. To the right Drury. side. And that one handled. Throws to first. Oh. One up, one down. And next for L.A., Taylor Ward. The left fielder. The 2 1. To third. Zips it to oh. first. Two up, two down. Now batting. The designated hitter, Willie Calhoun. Two outs, base is empty. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Willie Calhoun. They say you win. One ball, two strikes. Left hand batter waits. And that one is lifted in the air. Moore under it. Puts the squeeze on it. And the inning is over. And the Angels are gone in order. They're up to nothing. All set for the start of the Leading inning. And now the switch hitting catcher, catcher. Cal Raleigh. Cal Raleigh. And the pitch. And that's a strike. Here's a one two. Swings and misses, struck him out. A big first out here in the seventh via the punch out. Yeah, it just does so much to change the outlook of an important inning like this. I mean, you got the leadoff hitter so critical in setting the table when you got a tight game like this. So a strikeout really puts them on their heels. And he walked him. The batter now, Jorge Polanco. Step off, throw to first. And he's back in standing. To first, and they've got him picked off. To second, and he's out. And a pitch. 
And that one is inside. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. Luke Rayleigh to bat next. Swing and a miss. Three and two now. Well, you know this guy wants to pitch off something that he can hit hard and drive over the wall. But you've got to set your sights down a little bit. You can't lose your discipline and go after a pitch that you just can't do anything with. Popped up. Drury makes the grab, and that's the inning. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the tradition. Righty reliever out of the pen, Gregory Santos. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of him right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. And now the catcher comes up to him, Logan Ohapi. Next pitch is outside, and that's ball two. Pretty easy to give up on that pitch right there. Started on the edge of the plate with the spin. You know it's going to finish well off the plate. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Here comes a pitch. Keeps the at bat going with a foul ball. This one in the air right field. Robles glides to his left. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one down. Here's the center fielder, Mickey Modiak. Next offering is down low. Two and one. Bullpen activity starting up now. Mike Bauman is loosening up. This would be his first appearance for the club. Next one misses, and that's ball three. And now it's filled up. The 3-2 three, is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Oh, you know this guy wants to swing it, but he's showing some good patience in this one. It's the second time he's taken ball four. Moniak. Stands at first with one out. Ground ball to the right side. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. Flip to the pitcher is in time. And they get it out of the play. The battle, the right field. So in now for the Angels, Joe Adele. Man at second. That's a strike. That misses, and it's two and two. Two outs, and one in scoring position. Next offering in the dirt. Three and two now. Luis Guillorme waits on deck. Man on second, two down. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Here's Luis Guillorme. 3 2. Fouls it back with two strikes. Lined, and that's a base hit. Moniak around third. He'll score, and they're up by three. Love how he became a really tough out with two strikes right there. Takes an inside pitch and just fillets it over there to left field. And that's all he had to do is get something to the outfield grass to push that run across. Now it's going to be on the ground right side. Polanco tosses to first. And that'll keep more runs from coming in, inning over. But they pick up one run on the RBI single. It's now 3-0. It's Major League Baseball, and it's on the show. Welcome back, and a new arm on the mound to start the eight. Matt Moore. Your attention, please. 
And here's the first baseman, Luke Rayleigh. That one misses. And now three balls and a strike. Action in the Angels' bullpen. Carlos Estevez, the closer of the staff, is throwing. The pitch. There's a swing and a drive. That one's deep. And out of here. He'll circle the bases, and they cut into the lead. It's 3-1. Just relentless. This team will not quit. Oh, that one got in the jet stream on a line drive. We saw the numbers on the backs of the jerseys of the outfielders, which is usually bad news, and all of a sudden, they're back in this ballgame. Here's Victor Robles, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. Swing and a miss. It's two and two. Always exciting to see a leadoff home run in an inning. Kind of gets the offense fired up, and you start to expect a big inning. Pitch misses, and the count's full. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Here's Josh Rojas. Here's a 1-1. One, one. Liner, base hit. Love how he let that ball travel, trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. Scott Service brings on a pinch hitter. Ty France, runner on first and one down for him. Swings and misses. One and two. Lefty continues to work, but the closer getting loose in the bullpen. Fouls it off, still one and two. With two strikes, may see some movement over there at first base, trying to stay out of a double play here. Tying run at the plate. Quickly to second for one, and that's two. One scores in the inning, coming on this solo home run. It's now a 3-1 ball game. You're Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth, Austin Volk. Just trying to keep this one close here, and this is where a bullpen can give their guys a chance to fight back into the game. Now playing left. Swing and a miss. One and two. You know, these Angels, digging into their numbers, have to be happy with the swings they're taking. They've hit seven line drives already, and even though some of them have been for outs, there's nothing wrong with delivering consistent hard contact. That's almost always going to lead to positive results. The next nope. offering misses. Two and two. Right side, hard hit. Polanco oh. tosses the first. Lead off man is out here in the eighth. No left field. Taylor Ward, the next to hit for the Angels. Oh. And there's a ball. Now you get to this part of the order. Yeah, there's some pop there, but more likely there's some base hits. So very important to be patient. Let the pitcher walk you, if he will. The 3 1. And there's nope. ball four. Ball four. Close pitch there, but you've got to forget about that call if you're out I'm on the mound. You can't Number let it affect five. you going forward. You've got really? to get out of the inning first. Cal and then if you want to be frustrated, take it out in the dugout. Popped up, foul territory behind the plate. He's got it, and there are two outs. 
Here's the Angels catcher, Logan Ohapi. The pitch. And yeah, that's too Two high. One strike. Ward off of first with Jewel A. That one in for a strike, two and two. Right handed reliever. Fouled off the plate. They'll do it again. And a pitch. Popped up first base side. Tries to make the play, but it's foul. Righty to the plate. Still two and two after the foul ball. Eighth pitch of the at back coming up. They take the force out, and that's the third out. Angels strand one, but they still lead it 3 1. Carlos Estevez comes on trying to close it out. Well, he's the guy they hope to turn to out of the pin to lock down wins. So this game is going to play on more or less. Let's see if he can wrap it up here. Back to the top of the lineup, J.P. Crawford digs in now. Three and two now. Swings and lines a base hit into left field. So a man on base to start the inning. Now that showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy, didn't try to pull the ball. He let it get deep, took the barrel right to it, and then extended through the swing for the line drive base hit. Swing and a miss as he chases that one darting out of the zone. Swings and misses, struck him out. Pulled the string of the changeup. You know, variant speeds can be just as useful for a pitcher as movement. As you see right there, it really wasn't a great location. But the fact that the velocity change had the hitter off balance, and that's all you got to do sometimes. Next one is off the play. And a count two and one. pitch on the inside corner for a strike just amazing to me how many closers and back end relievers just throw absolute gas these days I never would have had a chance 2-2 two -two now 99 miles per hour to finish him off well, interesting. He's looking very comfortable out of the stretch after giving up the leadoff single back to back strikeouts so they haven't been able to move that runner up, get him into scoring position, and try to have a better chance of scoring. I tell you, good job so far on the mound. He just needs one more out. The tying run at the plate. Got him! And that's the ball game. This was by no means an offensive outburst. Only four hits the entire game, but good teams find a way to win, and they did. And your final 3-1 for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Chambi saying so long. Victorious Angels, three runs, four hits, no errors. They left six in on base. For the Mariners, one run, four hits, no errors. They left four men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 35 minutes.
Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. And we remind you to please drive home safely.